What's going on with all my billionaires out there? This the God Hoods Billionaire. Welcome to Hoods Billionaire TV. Big favor, big abundance. Um, on today's episode, we got Flame Fridays. Flame Fridays, where I am going to go over a album that has dropped uh, in the past 30 days. Um, today's album I am going to be going over is that Kevin Gates Kaiser. Kaza, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Now I'm a fan of Kevin Gates. I, I've been a, I've been a fan of Brassy. You know what I'm saying? And um, you know I'm a, like I've I've stated it before in previous videos. His overall spiritual and mental evolution has been something to marvel at. You know what I mean? Like Luca Brassi, definitely one of them guys that you gonna respect. I respect Kevin Gates' moral foundation, his spiritual foundation, his mental foundation. You know, I respect his musical talent, you know, so let's just start with there. I know he kind of going through something with Drika, but that's their personal business. We don't get in nobody else's business. That's what y'all need to start learning. Don't be getting in other people's business. That's that man's personal business. Let that man work that out with his wife. But as far as this Kaza album, I'm going to keep it real. It was okay. You know what I mean? Like, I, I had to be honest and say... You know, it, it was okay. It wasn't his best effort, in my opinion. You know, it's definitely not giving me like that Luca Brasi 3 vibe. You know what I mean? To me, like, that's his best album. That This is like, I like the intro. The intro went hard. The intro, he was dropping some bo he was dropping some, some, some boys in there. You know, uh, other than that, you know, it might have been one or two songs on there, but not really just, you know, you kind of can tell when people kind of what space they in by the music they make, and it's just like, I don't know what space Brassy in, I don't know if he going through something with, if it's the situation with Drika, I don't know what it is, but, you know, it just ain't the, like I said, the intro to me, probably the best song, you know what I mean, he dropping boards in there, he got maybe one or two more songs on there, but it's definitely not like, like I said, messing with like Luca Brassy 3, you know, but, you know, typical standard gates, you know what I'm saying, like, um, you know, just something to vibe to. You can take a couple of joints off, put it on a playlist. You know what I mean? But I'm pretty positive he'll come harder. Gates in a good place. So, you know, I mean, like I said, it's not the Luca Brasi 3, but it's definitely, it's definitely, a, uh, like I said, just one of them albums you can take a couple songs off of and put it on a playlist that you already got. You know, now that's just my personal opinion on it. You know, I know Gates definitely come harder. Um, I'll give y'all a sleeper album to go check out is that Pretty Ricky Hyde from BSF, uh, Black Soprano Family, that Rick Hyde go hard, that Rick Hyde, and he produced a lot of them beats on there, that Rick Hyde, that Rick Hyde got some bangers on there, like, yeah, you might want to go check that Rick Hyde out if you looking for, like, some motivation grind music. Like yeah, I'm finna I'm finna go run up a bag. That's that's what you need to probably turn into. Definitely an underrated album. Definitely underrated. You know, go grab that. Go grab that. But go grab that Kevin Gates, man. You listen to it. Let me know what you think. You know what I mean. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. What y'all think about that new Gates? Y'all like it? Y'all rocking with it? Y'all think it's hard? You know, let me know if y'all rocking with it. You know what I mean? Y'all think it made it? It's not his best effort. He could come harder. Y'all let me know what y'all think, man. You know, in the comments. This the guy who's being there. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. This the guy who's being there. Big favor, big abundance. I'm gone.